Hey boss and fans, another mailbag here. And let's go ahead and get to it. This one, um, question from someone I cannot pronounce his name. Big surprise, huh? Anyhow, I'm happy to know that there is there are people out there other than me who think that Casamayor is undefeated. Right on. Yes. Great show. I think it needs more promotion. So yeah, I do too. Go <laughs> try. And help us out on that. Yeah. Um, anyhow. Um, I could help you with a good website or something. I don't know. Yeah, I'd be interested in that, pal. Uh, thank you and keep it up. Lee, sorry, I can't pronounce this. Uh, it's like Leusville Behejas or something. Leusville, maybe. I don't know. But anyhow, thank you for the email. Yes, Casamayor is. Absolutely. Undefeated. Really? see somebody else besides us that thinks that also. And we wanted to just explain why. I've yeah. got chalk all over my hands, but um, I'm writing. And dusting erasers for the teacher. But uh, anyhow, I got two checks by my name. But anyhow, the um, Casamayor, why we he's undefeated. undefeated? Well, let's go in order of the times he's been screwed, starting yep. with the Freitas fight. Yep, Freitas fight. The first one. Freitas fight, he did clearly win. Yeah. That was closer than it needed to be, for sure. That was the closest set of all of them, I'll still say. Out of the ones he's been robbed on. So. But he still did yeah. win. And, really won. and he at least should have had a rematch by now, which yes. he's finally getting. Maybe. Uh, Supposedly. Well, now it looks kind of unlikely. They tried to get with Freitas' people, and it looks like Freitas isn't uh, wanting to. Now, actually. Yep, he so, woke up. Uh, yeah, apparently. He realized he never had a chance, and he realized he'd been ducking him for the past four years. And then so, he got a gift, why risk yeah. the gift to And see. Joe Cortez in that fight was the referee, no big surprise there. He called a knockdown on Casamayor in the third round, where he clearly tripped over his feet. You can go back on the replay, see that the punch misses Casamayor, and he falls from tripping on his own feet. Uh, Cortez calls it a knockdown. Also took a point away from Casamayor somewhere in the middle of the fight, I believe, for holding and hitting. Not a blatant foul at all. Or maybe it was, but it, he hadn't warned him at all before that. No warning whatsoever. So just uh, out of nowhere, taking a point anyway. Just clearly biased toward Freitas. Yep, obviously. And, it and wouldn't this have... was when Freitas was the knockout machine, and everyone was mad that Freitas wasn't knocking him out, apparently. Yep. And That's why the knockdown was... Yeah. Call it, even though it was the bogus as hell. Yes, completely. And Casamayor did more damage to Freitas and hurt him more than Freitas did to Casamayor. And Freitas was the bigger puncher. And he clearly won Yeah, the and he just outboxed him. So yeah. really even not. with the two point deduction. Yeah, I mean, go ahead and take that if you want to. Uh, anyhow, that's just ridiculous. That's the first one. No. Number one. <laughs> Next one Diego Corrales. First off, he beats Corrales. First, clearly. six rounds. Yeah, six rounds. Not two yeah. out. Gives him an immediate rematch. Yes, he for no reason. He doesn't pussy out like Corrales no. did, but... Doesn't. He says, okay, people have some doubt about who would have won or what I'll was happening. I'll beat your ass again. Yeah. And he does. And he did. Twelve rounds this time. Knocks him down. Knocks him down in the tenth. Yeah. <laughs> and just... This was the worst robbery of them all, because he clearly beat Corrales worse than any of the guys he's been robbed by. And I had it like, I think, nine rounds to three or something like and, that. And a point for the knockdown. Yeah, of course. And so just disgusting display. And you can even tell Corrales was the only one celebrating in his corner. Yeah. That was the most pathetic. This was a, uh, his old yep. trainer, Goosen. Of course, Goosen changed him out to Corrales. Gone yep. to Corrales, which, yes, um, Casamayor shouldn't have left Goosen. No. There was no point in it. But no reason. That's no justification no. of screwing him Absolutely over. Absolutely not. And the go the Goosen, his face, everyone in that corner just looked defeated. They looked like we're screwing this guy over. Yeah, and we didn't really win, but hey, we're getting the win on the scorecard. So. They just did not look celebratory at all. Yeah, Corrales was the only one celebrating. Oh, it was a horrible job of acting by him. I mean, well, he yeah. ran around the ring. Uh, he knew he lost yeah, the fight. And he Everyone did his best. in that corner really knew, and they didn't even try to hide no. it. He tried to, didn't do a good job at no, all. No, which it looks pretty pathetic when you're the only one 
Well, Celebrating. It looks pathetic anyway that he would be that happy with a decision win when he got knocked out in six rounds. So yep. let's say he beat him. Yes, yeah. let's say he beat him twelve rounds to nothing, and he really did beat him. How could he be satisfied with that anyway, knowing that he got stopped by him in the uh, previous fight? So, and which at least uh, Casemiro won the war on that one. Yes. You know, he's put that one to bed with his uh, right. last fight. That's right. And, <laughs> Um, when Corrales did not make weight, yes. weight over 140. more than Castillo. More than Castillo. And Casemiro took the fight anyway. And he had prior knowledge did. that this could happen, and it was a concern prior to the fight. Yeah. So, take that for what it is. Yeah, we mentioned that several times. So. And got a very light fine by the commission, and not very much happened. And no at suspension all. at all. Nope. Unlike Castillo, who they came down very hard on. So, Way too hard on yeah, in comparison. Definitely. At least do the same. Yeah. At, at the, the least, least the, the same. Least. Yeah, definitely. I say more because he's such a hypocrite and made such a big deal out of it. Really. But any other stay on the topic, <laughs> we don't want to get too far off. Um, the Castillo uh, the, the Castillo yeah, fight. Yeah, Castillo fight, okay, same for, year. First off, this was supposed to be the bitch Corrales <laughs> fighting. <laughs> Against Castillo. Notice some trends here with Corrales, yeah. he's a bitch. Yes. But um, anyhow, he pulled out of the fight. Didn't get enough money, some bullshit. Some DS. Yeah. Uh, anyway, Casamayor, this was like three weeks before the fight was scheduled to. Casamayor stepped in, fought him on short notice, beat him, clearly beat him, Con uh, won at least five out of the first six rounds, clearly. Just, I don't remember Castillo winning a punch for the first six rounds. Yeah, but. and this, this and I, his I head going back every five seconds. I, I might even call this the biggest robbery possibly, because I, I thought I had him. This was the second one. Like, I thought I had Casemiro winning like ten rounds to yeah. two or something. Yeah, I'll stick I, with the but yeah, but either way. But those two are the top no, two. He, he, did, he didn't really hurt. No. Castillo, Castillo has an iron chin, basically. He, did, he didn't really hurt him, no. but he did completely embarrass him. Outbox, he made him miss this, terribly. This was a terrible decision. Yes. And it was complete robbery, because Castillo did nothing. No, no. He did nothing in the fight. And 117 to 111 was one of the scorecards. Absolutely. When I heard that, when I heard that, I basically jumped up because I said, okay, that's Casemiro, so without a doubt, there's no way to have that for Castillo. Yep. And then, and still champion. Uh, Absolutely ridiculous. Sickening. I almost threw up. <laughs> It was it was bad. It was yes. bad. I didn't almost throw up, but yes, it was just absolutely disgusting. And why did they do this? So we could get so, a Corrales Castillo fight, they which were could so have happened that night. To have that fight. Yep. Which could have happened that night if some bitch didn't pull out. So once again, uh, Corrales and Castillo benefit from yeah, um, Casemiro being wrong. Yep. And also the Kid other, Diamond fight. Yeah. Yep. We Knocked him down in the first round. Now this one was called a draw. Yeah. So it was lose. a loss. Yeah. That but they were they were um, at least um, starting to give Casemiro a little bit. Of, I don't know if you've got credit, but no. they at least didn't give him the loss. The, loss. the so, bogus loss that it would have been. But bogus draw definitely clearly won this one. He let Diamond back into the fight more than he should have. Yeah. Definitely. It was closer than I thought it would be. But, but he still, did, he's, he clearly, he's still clearly no beat. way to have it anyway. But him winning by decision, knocked him down in the first round. Almost had him out completely in the first round. Yep, Casamayor. So, yeah, Casamayor. Not, not a power hitter at all. And Diamond is the supposed second coming of Tazu. Uh, not a great compliment there, I guess. <laughs> um, anyway, Casamayor embarrassed him. He's and not as good as Tazu. No, ever he's was. not. Uh, or is powerful, or is anything really? Yep. Uh, so, uh, he's just gay. <laughs> yeah, he is. A rat tail hold up. Yep. But phony tail get real. Just it's ridiculous. This Castle That's four situation. of the fights. Yeah, that, that's his four that he's been robbed in. He should be undefeated, definitely. He can't believe the Corrales fight. The they the, gave him the win like he deserved, and that, that was the closest. Probably of all of those that we just mentioned, actually, I would say, maybe. But anyway, but anyway yeah. and now all that time has passed that he's been screwed, and he's not getting younger. He's, no. he, and he's one of the oldest top fighters in the game right now. He's from Cuba. Yeah. He was stuck yeah. in the amateurs until he was able to get out there. Finally escaped. Yeah. Thank and he's 
had a lot of time just stolen from him because of these BS robberies. Yeah. He's a lot better than anyone knows. He's yes. one of the best kept secrets, probably the best kept secret yeah. in boxing today. The most underrated fighter in boxing, definitely. And I want to go back to last week. People like saying Emmanuel Augustus, yes? That's well, true. he's definitely Manuel one of Augustus them. is one yes. of them, but Casamayor even more so. Yeah. People appreciate Augustus more than Casamayor. Cas Casamayor, not Casamayor.